Let's go to Target and do some self-care shopping. I have run out of all of my self-care products yet again. My shampoo, conditioner, shaving cream, razor, you know, all of that good stuff. So, of course, I wanted to make a video out of it. I love going self-care shopping and I love recording it for you guys because I know that you guys love my self-care shopping videos as well. So, we're gonna go to Target right now. We're gonna see what we can find. Hopefully, try not to spend too much money, but that is not guaranteed. You guys already pretty much know like these kind of videos. I've made two of them already on my channel, so if you guys haven't seen those, go ahead and check those out. So they have an Ulta in this Target, which is honestly kind of dangerous because because I feel like every Target, they're like putting Ultas in them. So we're gonna go look around. I don't know if I'm gonna get anything from this section, but we'll see. I've never tried anything from Florence by Mills, but I've heard like kind of good things about them. This mask looks pretty cool, but it's like $18. So I love the section right here. I love all of the little sample sizes. So this is new. I'm honestly kind of tempted to try it because it looks really good, but I honestly don't know that much about the Pons brand. I've bought it a couple times and I liked it, but this looks pretty cool. I like the packaging of it. I remember being so obsessed with this Vaseline, the cocoa butter one. You guys, I found the L'Oreal Lumi Lotion. This is supposedly a dupe for the drunk elephant ones. I don't know if this is the darkest shade that it comes in though because I feel like everyone gets the darkest one. So yeah, this one is the darkest one. I think that's the one that everyone gets. But I've never tried the Drunk Elephant one so I honestly don't really have anything to compare it to. I wanna try it out just to mix with my moisturizer. So I think I'm gonna get this one. So they have the Glow Blush from Pixie. And oh my god, I literally... And this is such a pretty shade but I have so much blush at home and I just feel like I'd be wasting money by getting it but it looks super good and I love this shade of pink. So I've seen this brand like once on TikTok and I think I wanna try something from them. I think it's just conditioner and shampoo that they have. And they have a skincare deodorant, so I don't know if that's like actual deodorant or you like rub it on your face. And I don't know if you guys can see, but it's actually refillable. I think it like says it somewhere on here. And I don't know, but I already have deodorant, so I don't need this, but this just looks super cute. The packaging is like adorable. I love the pink. So I definitely need a dry shampoo. I've always just gotten this brand right here. And I feel like it's like, you know, never done me wrong. So I think I'm just gonna get a dry shampoo. But I've also seen this brand a lot. I feel like they have this at TJ Maxx though. So I don't know if it's like that good or not. So next I need a face wash. I think I'm just gonna get my CeraVe again. This is gonna be like my third time repurchasing it. So I really like it. So I got this brand a while ago and I really liked it. I stopped using it. I don't really know why, but I remember really liking this. So I think I'm just gonna get this shampoo and conditioner and they smell really good. So that's also a plus. And I picked up the repair one because my hair is kind of dead. So it needs like repairing. And I feel like anything else just makes my hair oily. So we're gonna just stick with the repair. I honestly love hair masks, but I feel like I do it like twice and I just like forget to do it. But this brand is really good. I've tried it once and it made my hair super smooth. I just feel like I would never use it. I really am tempted to buy this, but it's curl enhancing and I'm like my hair is kind of like wavy and I feel like it just would not do anything for my hair. So we're gonna leave it, but they also have this. I think I actually might buy this just because it's small and this strengthens and restores your hair. So we're recording on my phone because my camera just died. Unfortunately, I don't know why I didn't charge it, but I've never seen this brand before. It's kind of expensive, but I don't know if that means it's good or not.
So now we're on my favorite aisle. I love looking at the body washes. I'm definitely gonna try something new because I do that every time and I get bored of like the same scent. I think I wanna get something from Dove because Dove makes my skin super smooth. And oh my God, that smells so bad. We're gonna try the renewing one. I'm gonna smell this one and see how that is. Okay, that one smells pretty good. I feel like I can definitely find better. I just feel like this smells so much like shampoo and I just, I don't know, this is definitely like more of a hair scent. I don't know if that makes any sense, but it just, I don't know. It's good, but just like for my hair. I feel like I've heard really good things about this Odell brand that I feel like but like I feel like that's for hair so I don't know like about their body wash this is kind of like dirty so we're gonna smell this one see how this is so the last time I filmed this video I got this body wash and I ended up really liking it so I think I want to get something from this brand again just because I really liked it last time and I want to try something different from them so i smelled this one and this one smells really good and it does kind of smell like shampoo a little bit but i'm so done with like smelling a bunch of these because i'm super picky so we're just gonna get this one so i've bought this coconut mango shaving cream before and i really liked it but for seven dollars i don't think i like it that much and I've never tried out the Pink Citrus Eos Shave Cream before, so I think I'm gonna get this one. I've had all of these, so I just wanna try a different scent. And of course, we're gonna get a razor. I always get these ones and, you know, they're kind of cheap and I like them because of these like pink things right here. Did anybody else used to be like obsessed with these like pore strips? I used to use these all of the time. It was so bad. So I've heard Aragon Oil is good for your hair and it's only seven dollars so i think i might get this just because i really like leave-in conditioners and i'm kind of picky so i've just you know i've been wanting to find something new but i don't know what's better for your hair coconut oil or argan oil like i have no idea so we're gonna get the coconut oil we're gonna see how this is i'll let you guys know i've been thinking about trying these for a long time these are like sugar scrubs so i guess you like rub them on your skin and it like exfoliates it I've seen these everywhere and I'm contemplating on buying these, but champagne looks really good too. So I think I'm gonna get these ones just to try out. I love trying new products. So every time I come to Target, I always look at the little mini size things and I think they're so cute. Honestly, in popular opinion, I think these don't work at all. Like I've tried them and they just don't do anything. I think this bag is so cute just to like keep in your purse or something and like put all of like the girly products in. I think this is super cute. I feel like I would never use it, but it's super cute. So I found this. This is a teeth whitening pen and I've seen so many TikTokers use this and I've been wanting to try it for so long. This is only $10, so I don't even know if it's going to work or not, but I really hope so because I just love the concept of this. I think it's super cool. So I kind of want to get a new Colleen Hoover book. I want to get Without Merit. This is like one of the only books I haven't read by her yet. And this book right here, literally my favorite book by Colleen Hoover. This one was amazing. I would do anything to like read it for the first time again. So I think I've spent a lot already, so I'm gonna go pay for my stuff and then I'm gonna show you guys a haul of everything that I got. I'm so excited. I feel like I've gotten a lot of good stuff today. So I spent $100. All right, you guys, so I'm back in my car right now. I'm gonna show you guys a haul of everything that I got and I spent $100, which I mean, kind of expected. I don't know if I thought that I was gonna get out of that, but I'm really happy with everything that I got. So I'm gonna show you guys right now. So it was super loud in there. So I really hope I got some good footage and it wasn't like super annoying in the background with all of like the kids screaming and stuff because I forgot that the Target here that I go to in California is like super busy all of the time. First thing we got without merit, this is a Colleen Hoover book. As you guys know, I'm literally reading all of her books. This is like one of the last ones I have to finish. A Red Bull. A necessity i'm actually gonna drink that right now <sighs> so i got some razors this is another necessity i'm like the blades on my other razor are like disgusting so it was about time i got 
some new ones. I got these um, champagne shea butter and aloe sugar scrubs. These look so good, you guys. I'm so excited to have like a self-care night and try these out. I got some dry shampoo just because I need it because my hair gets super oily and I don't like washing my hair every day. So this like comes in clutch when I need it. I got my favorite cleanser of all time. This is the CeraVe cleanser. I love this stuff so much, you guys. This is literally what keeps my skin so amazingly smooth and, you know, hydrated and it doesn't, you know, cause me to break out or anything like that. I also got two shampoo and conditioners. These are the Herbal Essences one. They're both with argan oil. Argan? I don't, I don't know how to say that, all right? Argan oil? We're just gonna keep it at that and obviously it's supposed to be like good for your hair or something i honestly don't really know and then you guys saw this i got the coconut oil from the brand hask or i don't know i don't know if this is the brand or if this is the brand i don't know but either way i got some coconut oil for my hair i love leave-in conditioners a lot and i feel like you know you can never go wrong with a good leave-in conditioner some shave cream this is also another necessity i also got the shea moisture uh strengthen and restore treatment mask for my hair i love trying out hair masks like i said in the video earlier on i use a hair mask like twice and then like i forget i have it and i just like never use it so this is like really good just for like a one or two time use some body wash i was getting really frustrated in the store because every single body wash that i smelled i did not like at all so i kind of just like settled on this one yes it does smell like shampoo and you know we're just gonna ignore that for the time being i really did not want to be in there for just you know 30 minutes smelling sh um body washes and stuff so you know i settled on this coconut one is this even coconut coconut miracle oil yeah coconut and vanilla so it should be good this i'm really excited for i got the arc teeth whitening travel pens i love keeping my teeth white all of the time and I don't know if this is gonna work. Finally, I got the Lumi Glotion. I honestly had no idea. Like, I mean, well, I honestly did not think I was ever gonna find this because like dupes and you know, the real products, like everything is sold out right now. Just because like this is trending like crazy and I really did not think I would get my hands on this that quick. So I'm probably gonna do a review on this on my YouTube shorts or something. But for the time being, that is everything that I got. I really did get a lot of stuff. I didn't really realize until right now. But anyways, you guys, I really hope that y'all enjoyed this video. And the next time I run out of all of my products again, I will be making another self-care shopping video just because I love making these videos. But anyways, I really hope that you guys have an amazing rest of your day. And I hope to see you guys all in my next video. Bye.